Hello, Veta121 here, and uh, this is going to be my new kind of side whenever I feel like doing it kind of let's play, and yeah, this game is made by Bethesda Game Studios, and it is Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Now, you might be asking yourself, yeah, I do want to I do want to start a new game. You might be asking yourself, why would I do a let's play of a game like this, a game that seemingly probably never ends and takes most players like the rest of their lives to finish? Well, I've actually I actually bought this game last November and uh I just installed it on my computer like just now and I figured, you know what? I'm probably not really going to play too much of this game uh, on my own because I don't have, well, that much time all the time. So, like, I might post this instead of uh, the other side LP that I'll be doing, you know, like the retro games and stuff like that. So I figured, you know, this is kind of a nice little thing to do every now and then. And, uh, yeah, I've never played this game, so it's going to be completely blind. I have played Morrowind and Oblivion. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Thief. Okay, so yeah, use the mouse to look around. Empire was nice and lazy. They hadn't been looking for you. Could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's the storm cloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in vines now. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be in the home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. The headsman? Let's get this over with. What are they gonna do? Execute us? Oh crap. Akatosh, the vines, please help me. Hmm. I don't know how we're gonna get out of this one. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. Hmm. is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Yeah, who knows? When I was a boy, imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. It's like, yeah, you're not going to be watching any executions yet. You're too young. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. Uh, why not? Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them we weren't with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. No care of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not 
not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Uh, alright. Who are you? Alright, so who are we? Well, I guess the default class right now would be Nord. Although I'm not going to choose a Nord. But I might as well go over the races because they're pretty much the same as in Morrowind and Oblivion. I haven't played the games before Morrowind. I think that one of them was called Daggerfall and then, um, yeah, I can't remember. I don't even know the names of the first two games. But I have played Morrowind and Oblivion. Okay, we have an Argonian here. Uh, this is a reptilian race. They are um, good at swimming underwater and they are resistant to disease. And they have the hits hissed skin ability generate health very quickly okay that's new I don't remember that from the previous games unless well I never really used this uh, class anyways and then we have the bread and this one's pretty good these uh, th this race right here is actually pretty resistant to magic and they're pretty good at casting magic too so uh, yeah and, th and they have the dragon skin ability to abs to help absorb spells so yeah the Bretons are pretty good uh, the dark elf they are resistant to fire, and they're pretty good at stealth and magic skills. Uh, this is a pretty cool class. I'm not going to use it. All right, this class right here. This is what I'm. This is going to be my bread and butter. This is the class I'm going to choose. Also known as Altmer in their hold land of Somerset Isle. The High Elves are the most strongly gifted in the arcane arts of all the races. They can call upon their highborn power to regenerate magic quickly. So yeah, if you're using a mage type class or whatever, this is the character to use. However, there is a drawback. Uh, this race right here is very, very vulnerable to magic. They're really good with magic, but they're vulnerable to magic. Unless they changed it in this game, I don't know. Imperials, yeah, these guys are like skilled diplomats or whatever. I never use them. Nothing interesting about that to me. And then we have the Khajiits. These guys are... Uh, basically thieves or they make good thieves um, and they can see in the dark and they have unarmed claw attacks okay that's new I don't remember that from uh, well yeah I don't think you could do that in the, in the original game or in the previous games you have the Nord these guys are good warriors and resistant to cold and you have the orcs which um, can be powered up in battle with their berserker rage ability Pretty good class if you want like a melee fighter or whatever. And you have the Red Guards, which uh, these are also very good um, warriors. They uh, they're good at traveling too. I guess <laughs> they have high constitutions. And then we have a Wood Elf. When you have they, these uh, have natural resistances to both poisons and diseases, and they can command animals to fight for them. Yeah, I never really use that, but I'm gonna go with a High Elf. And, uh, what do I do? Hit R. Finish and name your character. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to call myself Vet. Veteran 0121. Hit Hunter for accept, and we should be good to go. You are not with the Thalmor Embassy, are you, High Elf? No. That can't be right. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your wow. Wow. I'm sorry. Fuck you, Thanks bitch. Remains a return to the Somerset Isle. Follow the captain, prisoner. That that is seriously fucked up. She's like, you know what? Screw you. You're gonna die anyways, even though you're not on her list. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. Ooh. What was that? Yeah, what was that? Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Yeah, basically, I know nothing about this game, so... No spoilers. You can give me tips, just don't give me spoilers, I guess. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over wish come on I 
haven't got all morning. <laughs> okay, so they're gonna. Yeah, are they actually gonna show the killing of this guy? It kinda looks that way. You say the same. Ooh, wow, look at that. It's a little gory. So yeah, if you're if you're like under the age of ten watching this, um maybe you shouldn't <laughs> maybe you shouldn't watch this, but well you can do whatever you want, but just know that there is a little gore and violence in this game. Did you hear that? I said next prisoner to the block prisoner. Nice and easy. Oh, aren't you gonna move the other guy out of the way first? I mean, I don't wanna, I don't wanna le kneel down right next to his corpse. I mean, that's kind of disgusting, isn't it? All right, fine. Hello, headsman. Whoa, what the hell is that? That looks like a dragon. Holy shit. And what the fuck? Uh, is my game screwing up right now? Is this supposed to happen? Whoa. So I am now unbound and I can you I can move around. Okay, well that's cool. Well, I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to follow this guy. What is that thing? Could the legends be true? Legends don't burn down villages. Yeah, they don't. Legends are legends. Whoa! What the hell? Holy shit. You know he's dead. Jeez. See the inn on the other side. Jump through the roof and keep going. Oh, okay, so yeah, space bar to jump. And we are now down here. Uh your hands are bound. Oh, okay. So I can't actually search that right now. So I guess I gotta jump down here. And, uh... Wow. Alright. So, hey, guy. Wow, man. All right, we'll do. Have to find General Tolias and join the defense. God's guide you, Hadar. Jeez, this is crazy, man. This dragon's tearing shit up. Whoa. Quickly, follow me. Sheesh, it's like right on top of us. Weapons, so it's not like uh, I can fight the dragon or help out or anything. We're escaping, Hadlar. You're not stopping us this time. Come on. I hope that dragon takes you all to Sovereign Guard. Okay, so we gotta make our way to the keep, which is right here, I guess. I don't know. So, yeah, if this game gets a good response, if you guys uh, want to see more of this. Then uh, I'll post a lot more and more often. Otherwise, this is going to be kind of a we should keep moving. Come every now and then thing. Okay, cool. You're going to do that for me, Let's huh? Cut you loose. So do it. There you go. Take a look around. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. Sweet. See if I can find something for these bones. All right. Better down here than. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. So we, can so we can use E to talk. Yeah, that's true. Nothing for it but to keep. See if one of these chests has some armor for you. Alrighty. So what is that? So we can search with. You better get some gear. Ooh, can take some gold. I will take some gold. You better get some gear. 
Yeah, okay, shut up already. See if one of these chests has some armor for you. Yeah, shut up. Shut up, dude. I mean, seriously, you just like, seriously, get some armor, get some armor. It's like, damn. I'm gonna smack you in the face if you say that one more time. Seriously. How do I, like... Oh, okay, so R, like, readies your fists or weapon or whatever. Well, that's cool. And we can take weapons here. We can take an iron sword. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. I'm just hitting buttons right now. Magic, magic, magic. How do we use magic? All. Okay, so... I gout a fire that does eight that does eight points per second. Targets on fire take extra damage. So wait a minute. Healing user cast heals a caster ten points per second. High will regenerate magicka faster for sixty seconds in fury. Creatures and people up to level six will attack anything nearby for thirty seconds. Okay, cool. So how do I select spells? Okay, so what? Left and then right. Left and right. How do you select magic in this game? Because that's what my character is going to be. Oh, sweet. See if one of these chests has some armor for you. Oh, that is freaking awesome. Look at that. Hell yeah. See if one of these chests has some armor for you. Alright, I will eventually. Um, what's in here? Yeah, I'm gonna be a mage. I'm not gonna lie. That's that was my uh, bread and butter when I was playing uh, Oblivion. Was was mage type character. Like the mage's skill was my my, my thing. Uh, is there anything in here? Apparel. Okay, so we can look at the stuff that's in here. Foot wraps and miscellaneous Ooh, gold. I will take. The, is that all we can I equip? I'm not trying to equip. I'm trying to. Chest. What's in, there's nothing in the chest. Okay, so how do I get out, dude? I'm gonna fucking shoot fireballs at you. If Shut up! Fucking bullshit. Imperial light helmet and five gold. Yeah, see, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna go for that. I'm not even gonna equip that shit. Uh, ooh, here's a key. And, uh, yeah, I don't fucking care about the damn armor. Oh, okay, that's how you change views. You just use the mouse wheel or something. Well, that's nice. Better down here than out there. Wait a minute. What does that do? Oh, it opens the door. Oh, nice. Hello, Mr. Antler, dear person. Be nice if I had, like, a... a spell to illuminate rooms right now or something. Tab to access your inventory and magic. Yeah, okay, I've already, I've already done that, I think. So, what's in here? But yeah, this game is... Like, Morrowind and, and Oblivion were amazing. I'm sure this game is just as amazing as those games. But, uh... Uh, maybe. Hold on now. We don't. If you want to die. Whoa! Yeah. Holy crap! Hell yeah! Burn! Burn, bitch! <laughs> that is awesome. Uh, Stormcloak Curious. This is light armor, fur boots. Yeah, you have diff different types of armor in this game. Or, if it's anything like the, uh, the previous games, that's how it goes anyways. See, I want, like, cloaks and stuff. I don't want this crap. Uh, no. But yeah, that is pretty awesome, huh? That's pretty sweet. What is this? We got a lantern. 
Can we light this thing? Hold on a minute. Let's see. Tab. I wish that guy would just shut up and quit telling me to hurry up. Um, keys, miscellaneous lantern. Can we equip this? You can't equip this item. So what's the point of having it then? I don't know. I'm gonna take a pause break and be right back. Actually. All right. Anyways, had to take a little pause there. To see how much, how long I should say I've been recording. And uh, I'm gonna go to my magic spells again. So apparently I have this fury spell that costs 56. Holy crap! That's a it's an expensive spell, but okay, healing. I think I'll probably set this as my other one. Wait a minute. How do you... Left, right. Oh, okay, so you can set different spells to different hands. So, okay, so my... Wait a minute, that's ass backwards. Huh, that's weird. Yeah, I, I do a left click and it's my right hand and I do a right click and it's my left hand. Isn't that kind of backwards? Oh, well, I suppose I could get used to it, but I wonder if there's a way to change that. Well, either way, I'll figure that out maybe off screen or whatever, screwing around, but yeah, just uh, let me know if you want to see more of this. I mean, I'm going to be using a mage type character playing this game, but uh, th this this game could take like forever to LP. But if you know, if I get a good response from this video, then I'll post more of them. I'll post, you know, I'll, I'll still post more. I'll post more of them more often, I should say. I'm gonna, I'm going to be posting more videos. Just. You know, it depends on the response I get. If I get a good response, then I'll post more and more often. Otherwise, I'll just, you know, continue on with the retro games that I plan on doing before. But like I said, I want to want to kind of LP this game because it gives me a reason to play it, I guess. And also, you know, I, I had bought it and I forgot about it because I'm LPing all these other games and I just don't have time anymore. But, um... Uh, I have a little spare time today, so I figured I'd record this and post it, you know. If you guys want to see more of this, if this is your cup of tea, you know, just let me know. But, uh, yeah, anyways, I'm going to stop talking now and end the episode. That is all for this episode of Let's Play Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. This is Vato121. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.